A huge concept in economics is the difference between nominal GDP and real GDP. To help you understand it, I'm going to start you off with this. If I asked you to figure out the most popular movie of all time, how would you figure it out? One thing you could do is look at box office receipts. This is how much the movie earned in the movie theaters. Now I'm going to show you the list of the highest nominal box office movie receipts. Now take a look at this list of movies and how much money they earned. Now ask yourself what's wrong with using this method to figure out the best movie of all time. The answer lies in the fact that most of these movies are all relatively recent. So the nominal box of receipts are going to be higher for more recent movies when the movie ticket price is higher. But if you adjust for inflation, that'll give you the real box office receipts. This is the box office receipts for different movies adjusted for inflation. So instead of looking at the price of movie tickets in current dollars that change over the different years, we're looking at a base year dollars. So if each movie was just $5, this is the real adjusted for inflation box office receipts. Now which one of those is better to figuring out what the best movie of all time is? Obviously the real. It's the same thing for GDP. The nominal GDP is expressed in current dollars. It's the value of the stuff we're producing in a given year in today's money. Real GDP is the value of the stuff we're producing based on a base year price adjusted for inflation. Real GDP is a better way of figuring out how the economy is actually doing because it measures the actual output produced, not just the output plus all the prices that increased. So back to the question, if the nominal GDP is positive, then either the real GDP had to increase and we produce more stuff, or prices went up and we had more inflation. Now C is incorrect because an increase in nominal GDP does not mean we necessarily had an increase in real GDP. It could have been just because inflation went up and that's why nominal GDP is higher. D is incorrect because an increase in nominal GDP doesn't necessarily mean that we had higher inflation. It could have been because we actually did have more output, more real GDP. That's it.